What's up guys, welcome to Apex, thanks for tuning in. Here is some exciting information about the brand new One Device 7 based on Android 15. We are seeing some more details about the charging animations shared by CID on Twitter. As you can see, it has got this beautiful animation. The moment you plug in the charger, you are going to see this wave moving or floating right there on your screen. It looks pretty cool. I am really excited about this. Let me know what you think about this animation, the charging animation in the comment section. Now there is one YouTube channel which goes by the name Mobile Walla Bhai has shared a video in which One UI 7 is shown in its full glory. We can see that beautiful looking home screen with brand new icons. There is a beautiful looking clock widget sitting right there with the battery widget and even the icons are looking pretty cool. The weather widget is right there on top and the shape of this weather widget has also changed a bit. And you can see this quick panel now. It actually looks cool now. Uh, the previous quick panels which we have seen was not looking that great. Maybe this has been customized by the user here and it's kind of looking very well organized now. And one thing you can observe on the top we do not have the notifications now the quick panel and the notifications are going to be separate we will not have both of them together again this is borrowed from ios which is sad to see we will have to swipe down from one side to see the quick panel and swipe down from the other side to see the notification panel here you can see we have got the expanded quick panel here all these toggles are right there the toggles look slightly bigger and we have got these pill shaped toggles right on top and you can see these brightness bars uh, they also look pretty cool and right next to the brightness bar there is dark mode option right there and we also have volume panel right here on the quick panel and we can also see the volume toggle right there adjacent to this volume bar we still have these wi-fi and bluetooth toggles separate on the top and nearby devices device control and smart view options right there at the bottom and i'm sure these can be customized these can be moved around let's wait and see that these notifications are sitting in these capsules again the background is completely blurred by default and uh, we should be able to customize this using good lock however it's good to see this transparent background by default on this screenshot you can see the search bar is right there at the bottom it will be very easy to access the search bar now all this while the finder option or the search bar was there at the top of the uh, app tray but now we have got this at the bottom if you're using the phone in one hand this is going to be very very useful and when it comes to cameras you can see we have got all these many options right there at the bottom and on the top right corner, you can see the uh, megapixels there. It says 12 megapixel and we've got flash on or off button. Some of the options are still there on the top. I thought all of these options will be moved towards the bottom, but it looks like uh, there are a couple of options given right there on top. And we have got this menu button right there at the bottom. Adjacent to the zoom buttons, we can tap on that button to expand the options. And on the video mode, you can see we have got HDR plus button on the top right and HD settings on the top. We will still have to go to the top to uh, change these settings it would have been great if all these options were available right there at the bottom it would be very easy to access the phone in one hand and you can see on the lock screen this is the charging pill that you're going to get the charging animation looks pretty cool when the screen is locked as in when you plug in the charger you will see this capsule with the progress bar or the percentage bar which will show up right there at the bottom this is showing in green color which looks modern it's great to see these new leaks even before getting the official beta version thanks to mobile wala bai for sharing sharing these video clips on his channel. Let me know what are your thoughts after looking at these animations, the quick panel, the notification panel, the search bar, the camera app, the widgets. So what do you think? Do you think these are good? Drop a comment and let me know. Actually, after looking at this video on his channel, I felt that the One UI 7 is going to be something wonderful and it's going to be refreshing as well. I'm very excited. Let me know what are your thoughts. Drop a comment and while you do that, be sure to subscribe to the channel because you're going to learn a lot about your Galaxy phone. And as soon as we get the One UI beta, I'm going to share all the information that you need to know. So stay tuned for those videos and give this video a like if you find this video informative. Thanks for watching. You guys take care and stay safe. Cheers. Bye-bye.